Hey Alex Rome World, it's your boy, back again. Today I'm going to be making some cool stuff. So stay tuned. Actually, it kind of feels like a serum day. Um, I have this idea that is kind of like chilling in my head and I just want to give it a try, you know? And so I'm going to take a, a nice nice little sine wave like this put this on 128 BPM by the way August 2nd got the future base pack coming out for silent one it's got a hundred presets in it and it will literally make you cry it's so beautiful and I am going to make a video on how to uh, uh, I'm going to make a video on the preset pack as soon as it comes out. And I'm going to show you guys every preset in it. Well, maybe every preset in it. There's a lot of presets. It'll be available on my website. Yep, I have a website. On August 2nd. August 2nd. AlexRoomSound.com the website's kind of boring right now. It's not much going on on it. So what I'm trying to do is make a little plucky, plucky thing. I'm going to put this one up and up. I don't like that little, like, There we go. Plate reverb is by default sits in like mono, and I don't like that. So there we go, just kind of a weird sounding thing here. Kind of have this idea that I'm working in my head. It's gonna be like weird leads. It's probably gonna be a longer video today. So let's make a uh, let's get this serum going here. Yet another serum. Where? Oh. See, like that's why I, I consider myself sucky at serum because I can't find anything. Give me this and then it's just, I guess, pure sub. And then we're going to do one more um, I'm thinking a reverse reverb trick so we get something like none of these are gonna help me are they let's get this just do that So I'll take that and get some reverb. All right, so let's bounce this in place. Oops, edit, undo. Hint, hint, when you bounce in place, Try to give yourself a little bit of volume to work with. Jeez, man. There we go. That's much better. So, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to delete that. I'm going to take this. Well, first, let me save here because my computer, you know, my computer, you know. So, let's reverse this. 
and then let's just chop off this whole mess here bang and then right here we're gonna have some hard kick and bass coming coming in this is just it's not gonna be a drop but this is gonna be just, well maybe it'll be a drop i don't know Dude, oh, 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 I just got an idea. I just got an idea it's so good. There's tears coming to my eyes. There's actually tears coming to my eyes. I think that's the kick right there. That's what I'm going for. Right, right there, bang, bang, bang. Bang! Alright, so I'm gonna put that randomization down. I got this idea. But maybe that's what I need to do right there. And then I wanna go to distortion and down sample a little bit. Down sample. Bang, bang, bang. Let's do this. This is going to sound quite cool. So, let's, uh, uh audio units. Oh shit, I gotta bust this bad boy. So I'm gonna bust this bad boy. And then I'm going to chain to bus six ouch See, I want this one to end when that thing's done moving. So go. Oh. There we go, and then of course we need some A little bit of boost up here. Cut some of these sub out. And then compressor. Because God knows these native instruments drums are not compressed. But that's on purpose, that I think they want you to be in control of that. It's a little too loud. Now I want...
maybe I could use this. And then let's see if we can get more high end. It's getting a little loud now, guys. I apologize. And then let's get this duplicated here and just pick another one of these and Dr. Driller. How much time we've we been going? 23 minutes. Holy cow. to compress this.